I would like to thank and congratulate you on your choice of the course, Ethical Hacking. This course will guide you from beginner to advanced levels, helping you find the right path. My name is Luna, and I have been working in this field for the last four years. This course is suitable for anyone in the field, whether they are graduates, postgraduates, undergraduates, or 10th or 12th grade students. Even if you want to change your career or join as an intern, this course is important and open to selection. Now, why is this course essential in today's era? The reason is that every idea is evolving for business purposes. To grow a business on the online path, people are utilizing the internet platform. Therefore, when using the internet platform, we have a responsibility to protect the data. This is where the fields of cybersecurity and ethical hacking come into play, raising awareness. For instance, if you build your own home and neglect to install the main door, your home's security is compromised. The same concept applies to the internet, if you are growing your business, managing a website, and storing data in a database, it's crucial to take steps to protect that data. Hence, the cybersecurity field was established. The value of this course is currently very high, given the demand for its skills. People want to turn their creative ideas into businesses, and as they grow their businesses using the internet, they must consider the security of their data. The internet being a public network, securing private networks on it becomes crucial. Before delving into this course, it is essential to have a clear understanding of networking fundamentals such as public IP, private IP, and IP classes. In the ethical hacking field, this course starts by introducing basic hacking terms. Alongside this, you'll learn to use different operating systems, including Kali Linux, in parallel. The course covers networking fundamentals such as IP, ports, protocols, and DNS. It also delves into hacking phases, teaching how to hack systems and maintain anonymity. Additionally, you'll gain insights into malicious software, including viruses, their workings, and how they can compromise data. The course covers Google hacking, the Wireshark tool, its importance in networking, and installation on Linux and Windows. Furthermore, you'll learn about Burp Suite, its installation in Linux and OS, its significance, and the damn vulnerable web application, a platform for practicing hacking skills. The course covers various attacks, including database attacks, web application attacks, SQL injection, blind SQL injection, access attacks, cross-site scripting, XML attacks, brute force attacks, buffer overflow attacks, and more. Skills in hacking mobile devices and Windows operating systems are also part of the curriculum. Finally, as you acquire these skills, the course concludes with an understanding of cyber law. This includes knowledge about general laws, cyber laws, cybercrime, government awareness, and cybercrime portals at the government, state, central levels, and private organizations. You'll learn how to gather information, knowledge, and skills in the field. I hope you approach this course with a hands-on attitude, practicing each topic, and wishing you the best in acquiring this new skill.